the LG V20 user here and today I'm doing a video on the Samsung Galaxy A6 for AT&T prepaid so the Galaxy A6 is not here at AT&T prepaid it's $419.99 for the, for the Galaxy A6 from AT&T prepaid so it's a bit steep for this phone uh, this is a mid-range phone from Samsung uh, the price is a bit steep in my opinion y'all always get this one for cheaper on other prepaid carriers like Cricket, Boost, Virgin, and much PCS. But it's AT&T, so AT&T will charge more. It's AT&T, so it is what it is, guys. So there's the phone right there. You guys know what the frame and specs look like. Um, nice looking phone and stuff like that. It does have an 18 by 9 screen there, and you guys will notice it does have a front facing camera flash. It uh, also has a front facing camera, of course. Airpiece. Right side, you do have a power button left side you do have a volume up and down button on the uh, left side so it says here step up to the Samsung Galaxy A6 enjoy entertainment on the go with the, with the 5.6 inch MVD display capture the epic photos with the 16 map with the 16 megapixel red camera and remarkable selfies with the powerful 16 megapixel front camera right screen right camera and right press so Right price, mm, not really, it's a bit steep, but that's just me. If you guys have some like videos here, um, that's just me. Check out if you guys are interested. So that's the front of the, that's the front of the front. There you got the uh, power button right there on the right. Line button's right here on the left. Bottom of the front, you have micro USB microphone and 3.5 headphone jack there it is micro usb no type c unfortunately that's like the only thing i don't like about this phone that it is micro usb not type c on the back of the galaxy a6 you guys have uh the antenna band top and bottom you do have a rear facing camera camera flash fingerprint sensor right here at&t logo samsung logo and yeah and there's the front of the phone once again. Uh, battery is not removable, so do keep that in mind. Uh, it has like a metal finish to it, so it does look nice and stuff like that. Let's go down past this stuff. Keep it as of the Galaxy A6. Performance camera. The f1.7 aperture keeps pictures bright and clear and low light, while the 16 megapixel over camera takes trips photos. Selfie camera capture your best angle with the 16 megapixel front camera with the adjustable LED flash. So the front facing camera is 16 megapixels and it has the adjustable LED flash in front. So that is pretty oh, that, that's pretty cool there. Smooth design the edge to edge 5.6 and super MLED heaven day display delivers stunning clarity. Expandable memory. Enjoy up to 32 GB of built in storage with the option to add up to 256 GB of micro SD card there. Alright. Galaxy A6 this one does look nice. Uh, one thing I don't, don't like about it, guys, it is micro USB, not Type C. That's the only thing I don't like about the phone. But other than that, the phone's not too bad for what it is. This is, this is a mid range phone, so yeah. So it's low light, no problem. And F1.7 aperture keeps pictures bright and clear and low light. While the 16, while the 16 megapixel rear camera takes crisp photos, there is the um, Golden Game Braids. In San Francisco, it looks very nice. Elevate your selfies in any light. The adjustable L, the, the adjustable LED flash offers three levels of brightness, while the 16 megapixel front camera captures your best angle. All right. So that's pretty cool that the uh, front-facing camera, the front-facing camera flash has an adjustable LED flash. That is pretty nice. It's great for taking selfies in the dark. You know what I'm saying? More space for what matters. 
they take away to build and store to give you ample room to store what the option to add the 256 gigabytes with the micro SD card. So I, su I suggest you guys take advantage of that. Yeah, y'all see a Samsung micro SD card right there. Um, that's pretty nice. 256 gigs. That's a lot. So yeah. See more old bus. So they're talking about the screen here. The Edge 2 Edge 5.6 Super AMOLED Infinity Display delivers stunning content. Just like metal casing fits right in your pocket. So the front is metal there, and you guys will see that your SIM card and your micro SD card is on the left side of the front right here. The battery is not removable, guys, so do keep it in mind. It also has fingerprint on back. It um it unlocks fast. Special recognition and fingerprint scan lets you unlock quickly so you, you can get right back to it. So it does have facial recognition and fingerprint. So that is pretty cool. So you guys can use either one or use both. Totally up to you. A smarter way to use your phone. Instantly shop for something you see with Bixby Vision. Take a photo and use Bixby to translate the text, get news, reminders, and more with Bixby Home. So it has all the Bixby features on this phone. So, you guys are interested in that, check that out. Get more from the Galaxy, you guys see the Galaxy Watch in the, um, in the, um, the gear icon next there. <coughs> it says get more from the Galaxy. Pair gear icon X earbuds to stream music wirelessly. Sync with your Samsung smartwatch to get notifications and to track your workouts. Specific cases on this phone, you guys know what the specs are possibly. Uh, this is a later range phone, like I said. But not bad for what it is. The price for the AT&T version is a bit steep in my opinion. So the uh, dimensions of the Galaxy A6. Is 5.90 inches height, 2.78 inches width, and 0.30 inches depth. The frame weighs 5.71 ounces. Uh, it will be a bit hefty because of the metal casing around the frame. So yeah, um, it has a 5.6 inch display. It's infinity display with one go with device five. It's a it's a super AMOLED display. It is 14. 80 by 720. Then they meant 1440 by 720 pixels. 223 ppi there. You do have dual 16 megapixel cameras front and back. The back of LED flash. Uh, back recorded at full HD at 30 frames per second. And it says that you guys can get um, live video playback at 4K at 30 frames according to this. <clears throat> it has a 3000 mAh battery. The battery is not removable, so do keep it in mind. 19 hours of talk time, so 18 days of standby time. Audio playback is 44 hours with speaker or 64 hours with headset. It has an XNS chipset in there from Samsung, XNS 7884, 1.6 GHz octa-core. So, it is 32 gigabytes of internal storage, micro SD card expense up to 256 gig, 3 gigabytes of RAM. So, like I said, not too bad. It has Android or Oreo with Samsung uh, experience UI on there. I'm sure that that's a term of a pie events, I'm sure it will. It does have voice, it, it does have voice dialing and voice command, of course, Google Assistant and stuff like that. There's your bands there. Uh, it has um, HSPA, LTE and all that stuff, 3G, Wolfram, to quad band, HD voice, Wi-Fi calling, Wi-Fi connectivity, 8211, ABG, and then AC, dual band Wi-Fi. It, it does have NFC, Bluetooth 5.0, mobile hotspot up to 10 devices. It has motion suppression, dual mic noise cancellation, wireless emergency alerts. It takes the SIM card, I think it takes a nano SIM card, so it takes a nano SIM card, alright? Don't know why I don't have it listed here, but it takes nano SIM cards. 
uh, with the guy say, hey, six, you guys get a lot of, you guys will get a lot of ads from AT&T print style on the guys say, hey, six, you guys will get AT&T, car protect AT&T, device of AT&T, drive mode AT&T, hotspots AT&T, mobile security, AT&T messages back up and sync, AT&T protect, AT&T remote support, AT&T setup and transfer. Young guys have also have AT&T smart limits, AT&T smart Wi-Fi, AT&T visual voicemail, Direct TV, mobile services manager, and young guys get ads from Samsung. Young guys get Bixby Home, Bixby Vision, which is in your camera, device maintenance, dual messenger, easy mode. Find my mobile income office keyword personalization service client photo editor reminder S Finder S Health Samsung Glow Samsung Easy Sharing Samsung Galaxy Apps Don't use Galaxy Apps because that that that's trash. Don't use it. You also have Samsung Gear Samsung Knox. Samsung Note, Samsung Smart Switch, Samsung Smart Key, Samsung Plus, Sam Secure Folder, and you have Smart Things. Uh, so, you guys will get a lot of apps from Samsung. You guys get additional apps as well, like Amazon Shopping, Facebook, Facebook App Manager, Google Drive, Google Duo, Google Maps, Google Photos, Google Play Movies and TV, Google Play Store, of course, Google Search, and YouTube, of course. And you have My AT&T. Which provides fast, easy account access virtually anytime, anywhere. And you have Samsung Internet Browser and Google Chrome as your default browsers. Your sensors on the phone you have accelerometer, ambient light, fingerprint, geometric, and gyroscope. Sex messages there. Music part is, is Google Play Music. Um, you have 30, you have 30 surround sound, you have Dolby Altmost. Audio on this phone, that's pretty cool. And you have all the stuff here. See, we'll come in the box, see what it tells us. And what you guys get in the box, you guys are getting AC adapter, micro USB cable, and quick sight guide, and that's pretty much it. So, there you guys have it the Samsung Galaxy A6. Is not available at AT&T prepaid for four nineteen ninety nine. Uh, in my opinion, the price is a bit steep for this phone because, like I said, you guys can get this phone one different prepaid carriers for less than that. Uh, this is the launch price for the Galaxy A6 on AT&T prepaid. Uh, when boost, uh, when everyone else got that on prepaid, it was like three forty nine for theirs, but. Um, it's AT&T, so y'all so guys will be paying a bit more for it. I mean, I guess if you guys want to get this phone on AT&T prepaid, I should I I suggest you guys wait a little bit to see if the price will come down a little bit. Hopefully, it will, because like I said, when Cricket got there, it was like three forty when they got there. I think three forty three. I think it was 340 or something like that when Cricket got, got theirs. Uh, Boost and Virgin got theirs at 349 at launch. Metro got theirs at 349 at launch too. I'm not sure we, we, what the launch prices were. But I know when Boost and Virgin got theirs, it was 349 at launch. So 419 for this phone is a bit much. If you guys really want to get this phone, wait for the price to come down on, on the AT&T pre, AT prepaid. Or buy an, or buy an, I'm not Galaxy A6 and use it there. Uh, so yeah, there you guys have the Samsung Galaxy A6 now available at at AT&T prepaid for 4.19.99. So if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. It lets me out a lot. Peace, rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.